Hello, and thanks for watching. This is George at Wicked Warnings here with a brand new light gray Chevy. I like these new Chevys, they look a little mean. What we've got on this truck, as you can see here, here in the grill, we've got some of our Thin X. This is the L I N Dual Color Series in amber and white. We've also done the OEM DRL Flash. This will be a kit that's available soon on the website for the Chevys and GMs. If you need it before that, just drop an email in and request the OEM DRL Flash kit. As you can see, the white lights underneath the factory headlights there, that's what we're talking about. On the Thin X LED, we just went with a simple reversing pattern on the color. You can see a little bit better that OEM DRL flash that we have going on. I'll show you the side profile of the Thin X mounting right there on the grill. This is where we mounted our Thin X right here on the chrome belt line of the grill. It's a nice slim fit, doesn't protrude out too bad, and doesn't look too bad when they're off. I'll show you that once more. Here you can see how bright they are straight on. And here you can see how they kind of are a little discreet when they're not lit not a bad looking light on the front of this truck these grills are not the easiest to mount anything in so this is an easy quick solution if you're okay with having a couple holes you can just surface mount a thin x right on the front of the belt line here on the chrome strip of these chevys just like that they don't stick out too bad they look pretty nice so out back we did a couple of things first we have a dual color TIR6, actually it's a, yeah, it's a TIR6 based LED stick in the rear window. This is the dual color version. We've got LED HAWs in the cargo reverse and the step pockets. So this will be the setup on the worn function as far as the program switch. Let me show you what I'm talking about. Right here on our controller in the truck, you can see we've got worn flood left arrow right arrow siren main power and pattern right now we're in the warning mode let me show you what the flood mode does and the arrow modes do and that controller is mounted right there left of the steering wheel in a real nice spot right there where the credit card slot used to be we mounted over the credit card slot and securely mounted our mini six controller panel right there let me show you the back so out back here, we've got our amber LED duos, side fire in the steps. We've got our white LED duos in HD lens in the reverse and the cargo in an X pattern on a quick double flash. And as well, like I said, that dual color multi-feature LED stick in the rear window. The customer specified that we absolutely need an arrow stick in the rear window, so we have arrow functions on this stick as well. This is just a pattern that I chose that has a little bit of white chasing the amber. Of course, you can pick any pattern you want. We did install the pattern switch button on that controller, as I showed you, so the client can feel free to choose whatever pattern he likes for the warning or arrow stick feature of that LED stick in the rear window. As you can see, we've got the right arrow just as well as the left. I'm going to show you center out as well. When you push right and left together, you'll get a center out like this. That'll be our center out arrow feature. Let me show you what the flood mode does in the back. We've got the arrow stick on solid white. We've got the cargo and the reverse all solid white on the flood mode button. This way we've got some extreme white light to the rear of this truck. And let me show you how that looks on the actual back shop wall to show you just how much light we're really putting out here. All right, so I've darkened up the shop here a little bit, and I'm going to go ahead and sneak over to the truck and turn on that flood again so you can see. As you can see, uh, <laughs> quite a bit of light back there. Uh, definitely going to be a good improvement for this owner. Here you can see we elected to do our side mount on our step pockets. That's an LED HAW Duo LD lens there with our mounting gasket flange and we want side fire just to add a little bit of side warning to the back of this truck and it definitely fills the whole step up with a flash of light you can see it from the back and the side you can mount that light either rear facing or side facing or both if you uh, want to double up the steps I've got a couple videos that show both but uh, this client specked out to do it this way so that's what he got let me show you that controller mounting one more time and that'll conclude the video here in the truck, right next to the headlight switch, we've mounted that Mini 6 control panel. 
it's securely mounted from the back doesn't move at all and you can go ahead and turn on all your functions arrow stick flood whatever you need to do and shut it right down again this is a brand new Chevrolet with a custom package here for local municipality done at Wick Warnings if you want any of these packages please check the video description for a link to purchase or send us an email if there's missing items or something you wanted to add check out our social media feeds please make sure to subscribe to our email on our website check us out on Facebook YouTube Instagram and uh, stay tuned for more videos thank you again for watching wicked warnings we appreciate that you've watched this far have a great safe day everybody